While it may be a misunderstanding, it's also a reminder that social media can reach and enrage large groups of people overnight. In fact, the mother's Facebook post concerning her young son's gravesite prompted a quick response from management at Fond du Lac Cemetery. Crystal Donaldson explains. Monday night, Amber Smith posted pictures of her infant son's gravesite with the caption, this is what Fond du Lac Cemetery and Township deemed as necessary maintenance in my son's resting place. Complete and utter disrespect, not just for my son, but for all the babies. Amber first saw the dismantled grave for herself Saturday morning after hearing about it from her parents the night before. It's just, it's heartbreaking. That's a place for, you know, where my son rests and where multiple children and other people's family members rest. And it was just annihilated. The maintenance Smith referred to in her post is an actual project underway to remove old bushes. Behind me here in Baby Row at Fond du Lac Cemetery, you can see the dirt and the maintenance which has already started. The cemetery officials have said that the maintenance is necessary to keep the cemetery up to date and looking well. Fond du Lac Cemetery's office manager tells me she did get a few phone calls from infuriated people who saw Amber's post. When she left yesterday, she seemed to understand, and her friend seemed to understand as well. So I was surprised to wake up this morning and see it all on Facebook, and it has spread like wildfire. The cemetery will now receive the space to grow fresh grass. Cemetery managers tell 25 News they had no intentions of hurting the grave sites near the maintenance areas, and they only wanted to improve it. The babies were never disturbed in their places. The ground above it, yes. It does need to be seeded. The dead bushes are gone, but it will look great, and it'll be what they deserve because they deserve a pretty little park-like area. In East Peoria, Crystal Donaldson, 25 News.